musical gift cards, electronic toothbrushes, e-bikes, what do they all have in common? Well, they're all powered by lithium ion batteries. And as we get ready to gift new cool gadgets this holiday season, experts say it's crucial to know how to spot a problem and how to dispose of these batteries the right way. Be on the lookout for a swollen or misshapen battery, a device that suddenly gets hot or a strange smell. Cape Coral Fire says the most common reasons these batteries catch fire is because of overcharging, leaving them plugged in and unattended, or putting them on soft surfaces like beds or couches. During this holiday season, we have all kinds of new technology coming out that's going to utilize these batteries. And with great technology comes great responsibility. Make sure that you use your chargers in a secured area, on a hard surface, one that has good airflow. Never leave your chargers unattended, and always make sure you unplug your chargers when you're done. When you're ready to get rid of them, remember the acronym CHARGE. Cool the device down, handle it carefully, don't puncture or crush it, avoid throwing it in the trash, recycle only at approved drop-off sites, get it into a fire-safe container if it's damaged, and E, educate others that these batteries can start fires. Cape Coral Fire says getting rid of these batteries the right way is how they prevent those trash truck and recycling facility fires they see every year. Now you can dispose of them at the Electronics Recycling Facility in Fort Myers, also Batteries Plus, and even Home Depot and Lowe's. In Cape Coral, Emily M, Fox 4.